Hey guys, this is Matt here from Team Yu-Gi-Oh! Noobs, and today I just wanted to bring you a, a deck profile that was requested by one of my subscribers. I met him on Dueling Network and he requested a Blue Eyes White Dragon deck, so here I am with a build I just threw together today. Starting off, we got three Blue Eyes White Dragon, obviously. We got two Flam Valgard, it's a normal dragon tuner, so it works with Silver's Cry. We got one Red Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon because it's a dragon deck. Two Swartz Child Limit Dragons, two Black Dragon Collapse Serpent, one White Dragon Wyver Buster, one Eclipse Wyvern, one Divine Dragon Apocryph, two White Stone of Legend, and three Blue Eyes Maiden. Uh, moving on to the spells, we got one Ragaki, one Wing Beat of Giant Dragon, two Trade In, two Cards of Consonance, two Dragon Shrine, one Dark Hall, one Soul Charge, one Dragon's Mirror, one Foolish Burial, two Pot of Duality two Mystical Space Typhoon, and three Silver's Cry. And for the traps, we've got three Royal Decree. Now moving on to the extra deck. We've got one Five-Headed Dragon and one Blue-Eyes Ultimate Dragon because he really wanted a Blue-Eyes Ultimate Dragon in the extra deck, so I decided to throw it in there. Typically, you're going to want to summon this more because it's a lot better, but if you really want to summon the Blue-Eyes Ultimate Dragon, it's in there. We've got one Star Eater, one uh, Dragocytus, the Impure Underworld Dragon, two Azure Eyes Silver Dragon, one Armades, one Cataster, one Galaxy Eyes Dark Matter Dragon, two Galaxy Eyes Tachyon Dragons, one Thunder End Dragon, one Divine Dragon Knight Felgrand, one Silent Honor Arc, and one Lavalval Chain. Now the basic idea of this deck is to bring out a Blue Eyes White Dragon and a level 1 tuner, being Flamwell Guard, White Stone of Legend, or Blue Eyes Maiden, to bring out the Azure Eyes Silver Dragon. This lets you bring back a normal monster every turn. So your Blue Eyes White Dragons and your Flamball Guards, which typically you're going to go for the Blue Eyes White Dragon. Uh, there are other cards such as Silver's Cry that let you special summon from the graveyard. And then there's Dragon's Mirror, which lets you banish dragon type monsters from your field or graveyard to special summon a fusion monster from your extra deck with those listed monsters. Now, also with this deck, you have rank 8 Xyz monster potential, being in Blue Eyes White Dragon and Swords Shad Limit Dragon. So you can overlay for the Galaxy Eyes Tachyon Dragon, and then overlay for the Galaxy Eyes Dark Matter Dragon, which lets you send three Dragon-type monsters from your deck to the graveyard, and have your opponent banish three monsters from their deck. There are also monsters in here such as Felgrand, and Thunder End Dragon, which once per turn you can detach one of these material from to destroy all other monsters on the field. Now this card can only be summoned by overlaying two level 8 normal monsters, which are Blue Eyes White Dragon. It's the only one we have in this deck. So I'm going to show you guys a quick game against the AI with this deck. I know it's just the AI, but you know, it's... We're just going to do a single game. I'm going to just be playing against Yugi's deck really quick, just so you can see what the deck does sometimes. Now, not a great hand, but not horrible, because we can always just summon the... Uh, Blue Eyes Maiden and wait out because Blue Eyes Maiden when she's attacked negates the attack and special summons a Blue Eyes White Dragon from the hand deck or graveyard. Now we drew Royal Decree which is a good card to have. We're going to set the White Stone to get a Blue Eyes White Dragon out of our deck just to thin the deck a little bit. And he's going to attack it and kill it. So there's our Blue Eyes White Dragon. So now we've got two Blue Eyes White Dragons in our hand. We're going to activate our Royal Decree so traps cannot be activated. We drew a dragon's mirror. That's not great. Not doing not not good draws right now, guys. Ooh, the dark magician. I'm scared. Come at me. Okay, so we drew another royal decree. Not optimal, but Soul Charge will let us make a play this turn. So we're gonna activate Soul Charge, special summoning both the White Stones of Legend. Paying 2,000 life points. Then we are going to Tribute Summon for a Blue-Eyes White Dragon. Twice Stone of Legends trying to add another Blue-Eyes Fair Hand. And then we're going to Special Summon the Azure Eye Silver Dragon in Defense because it's got 3,000 Defense. It's a lot. Now we can end our turn and next turn we will be able to Special Summon a Blue-Eyes White Dragon from our graveyard. And we are just not drawing anything right now. So we're going to put him in Attack. And we are going to attack the Dark Magician. Mirror Force is negated because of Royal Decree. And then we're just going to end our turn there. 
Next, we're going to draw our card again. We cannot special summon a monster because we don't have another monster in our graveyard to special summon. So, what we're going to do is summon the Divine Dragon of Procrolith. Activate his effect by discarding Blue Eyes White Dragon. We're going to add the White Stone of Legend back to our hand. And then we're going to just randomly attack. Just to see if we can kill anything. I don't want to attack with this because it's only got a thousand attack. Now next turn we've got another normal type monster in our graveyard for Azurai Silver Dragon. But he's given us a shallow grave. So we got it back anyway. So this turn... I'm going to be able to flip that up. And we are going to special summon. What do we want to special summon? I'm thinking the Dark Matter Dragon. So we will overlay the Dark Matter Dragon on top of the Tachyon Dragon. And that'll let us send monsters to the graveyard, which is good because we're not having the best luck drawing them. So we're going to send Eclipse Wyvern. Uh, let's send the White Dragon Wyvern Buster and Flambell Guard. Then, Eclipse Wyvern's effect is going to activate, letting us banish a dragon-type monster, a uh, level 7 or higher, I think it is. Yeah, level 7 or higher, light or dark dragon-type monster from our deck. It's very important that we banish the Red-Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon for this. Next, we're just going to activate our Foolish Burial to get it out of our hand. Uh, we are going to send... Oops. We are going to send... Uh, Blue-Eyed Maiden, why not? Then... We've got a lot of stuff in our graveyard right here. So we're going to activate our Dragon's Mirror. Summoning the Five-Headed Dragon by banishing Eclipse Wyvern. Make sure you banish the Eclipse Wyvern. It gets the Red-Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon back to your hand. We'll banish a Wyvern Burster, a Apocryph, the Flamvel Guard, and the White Stone. So now we got this beast on the field. We're going to get our Red-Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon back at the hand. Then this is a dragon type monster, so normal summon this. We can special summon the Galaxy Eyes or the Red Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon, sorry, by banishing a dragon type monster from our field. So we're going to banish the White Stone of Legend. And then we are going to activate Darkness or Dark Matter Dragon's effect. Sending a blue eyes white dragon to the graveyard. Then we are going to activate the effect of Darkness Metal Dragon. Special summoning Blue Eyes White Dragon from our hand, apparently. Sorry, I misclicked. Oh well, doesn't matter. We've got a lot of damage on board right here. This is 2,800, 4,000, and he can attack two monsters. He can't attack directly twice. He can only attack two monsters. Uh, 2,500, 5,000, and 3,000. So we are going to have Dark Matter Dragon attack both of these monsters. And then we can just go in and attack for game. So we'll attack... Five-headed dragon first, and then because it's a blue-eyes white dragon deck, we'll let blue-eyes white dragon finish him off. All right, so thank you guys for watching. That's the deck right there. Uh, if you liked it, leave a like down below, comment, and subscribe to our channel. Uh, I hope this helps my subscriber. If you have any questions, just comment down below. Uh, I'll do my best to help you through it. But uh, yeah, thank you guys again for watching, and keep it strange.